Well, dozens of lobstermen were out on the water today, but they weren't working. They were protesting plans to build a floating offshore wind turbine near Monhegan Island. The rally included about 80 boats, according to several of the fishermen, and was held a dozen miles offshore, close to the spot where New England Aqua Ventus plans to build the wind turbine. The technology behind the floating platform is designed by researchers at the University of Maine and would be a first of its kind project. It would be in place for 20 years. Furthermore, Governor Janet Mills is proposing to build more of these floating wind turbines farther offshore in the Gulf of Maine. But fishermen say these projects pose a threat to lobsters and other marine life and that the underwater cable and other aspects are also a threat to fishermen. It's a threat to our livelihood. It's, 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 it's going to mess with the ocean and our way of life. There is no doubt about it. You said that even this, you're, you're even concerned that this one off Monhegan could cause problems. Like I said, this one off Monhegan, I truly believe, is the, the shoe and, you know, foot in the door to get more than one out there. Well, that site off of Monhegan Island was designated by the state as a test site for offshore wind platforms more than 10 years ago. New England Aqua Ventus says it is working with fishermen and other groups to make sure the project does not harm fisheries. It is currently surveying the proposed route for the buried cable to bring the power to shore, which is why the protest was held today.